and us um, for the better part of two years. So I want to say on behalf of CDOT, I want to say thank you to all of you um, for putting up with us for the last two years. Thank you. A couple of thoughts, um, and I'm going to be, I'm going to be very brief in remarks because I, um, I have a, a fairly long list of people that I want to thank um, before we get, uh, as we go into this program. Um, but first, just an order of events, um, I'm going to uh, introduce a few people. Uh, Mayor Gamp is going to come up after me, uh, then Galen Stewart, who all of you probably know and at one time or another swore at, uh, from Granite. And then Chris Dietrich um, from uh, Glenwood PD is going to come up as well. So that's the order of events. Um, but I want to, just a few opening remarks. Um, Galen, that is the biggest flag I have ever seen at a, at a bridge opening. Um, I know you, there are a lot of uh, there are a lot of Glenwood students here. Let, let's have any Glenwood students give a sh shout out. All right, all right. I was a Glenwood how student. How many of you? How many of you have had American history? How many of you? How many of you remember a guy named Benjamin Franklin? Um, and do you know that Benjamin Franklin was one of the signers of the Declaration of Independence? There'll be a quiz. There'll be a quiz on this later. And Benjamin Franklin, when he actually signed the Declaration of Independence, made a statement. And it went something like this. Don't hold me exactly to this, but it goes something like, We must hang together, or most assuredly, we will all hang separately. And two years ago, when I came down um, in January, when we were kicking off this project, Steve, you all remember this, uh, we were together... So the executive team of the CDOT folks, the contractor, the designers, the city of Glenwood, some of the major businesses that were impacted, um, Dan Blankenship from um, RAFTA was there. Many people that were going to be affected by this project were together, and we were all a little bit nervous about each other. And I think that we made a commitment to one another at that meeting that went something like, we're going to make this happen if we hang together. Because if we don't, it's not going to happen. So to all of you that were engaged in this project, as an observer, as a contractor, as a designer, as a city official, as a state official, as a business owner, congratulations to all of you for hanging together. Great job. At this point, I'd like to introduce Galen Stewart of Granite RLW Joint Venture, one of the... Uh, primary contractors on the project. Hello everyone, how we doing? Well, hopefully, uh, now that we got this thing about ready to open after 85 days, I am really relieved. I can probably go home and go to sleep tonight and maybe have a beer later. But I want to, uh, I want to take a little bit of time. I know Mike and, uh, and the mayor have mentioned a few people and uh, some businesses and things, but I want to I want to drill down on some of the people and, business and other subcontractors that really made it happen for us. As so. you know, so we want everybody to turn around and look up at the lift. We've got a photographer. He's doing our community picture. All right. Everybody turn that way. Are you ready? Okay, on my count of three, 
okay? Here we go. One, two, three.